hi guys welcome back to my channel and today i have something special to tell you guys i wanted to first say thank you thank you thank you to all my new subscribers who are new to my page i haven't been posting for a while i took a time out but i'm back i've been motivated there's been so many crazy things going on in the media um so many crazy things going on in the world i feel like uh I have things to say, but I just want to say thank you to my new followers. I appreciate you. Um, I run the type of page that I like to have input. I like to interact with my followers and things of that nature. So I do videos to where I'll ask questions and, you know, and I'll go back and respond to your guys' questions. But anywho, today... I have something new to tell you guys. The last time I came here, um, I told you guys about a um, craving, <laughs> a craving that I have. And um, I surprisingly got a lot of backlash. I, I don't know if I should just call it backlash, but there were a lot of people who kind of chimed in and said that they had some cravings as well. Well, today... Um, I have something new. The last time I posted, they were green olives. I had the craziest cravings for green olives. And when I say I would go through jars, I would go through jars and jars and jars of green olives in a short amount of time. If anybody knows what that means with the body, please let me know. I don't know if it's a lack of something or my body's craving something, but I would literally have my mouth salivating for those olive, for those olives. So today, can you guess what it is? How many of you guys have a crazy, crazy cravings? I, I would love to know. Leave your comments below. Um, if you've got to this point, don't forget to click the like button. Don't forget to subscribe. I appreciate you guys for coming and following me. Um, so uh, here it is, guys. Are you ready? Yes. Pickles. Does anybody else have a serious craving for pickles? And you know what? They're not just any pickle. Not just any pickle, because let me tell you a short story. This morning, I went to 7-Eleven, because you know how 7-Eleven has those little small packs of pickles? They started carrying those little packs of pickles, because I think that a lot of people out there are like me. They have cravings for something crunchy. They have cravings for something sour and delicious. And right now... My mouth is salivating just talking to you guys. So I go to 7-Eleven and what do you know? They have a whole section of pickles, okay? And I was so disappointed because they had pickles with garlic. No, thank you. They had pickles that were spicy with some type of hot sauce. No, no thank you. And then it had some type of a pickled vegetable, which was, I looked like it was like a green bean or something. I was like, uh-uh. I need my pickles. I need my kosher pickles. These are the ones I love. Guys, these pickles right here now, this one not, I don't like these as much. These are like the whole pickles. Um, they look a little bigger in camera, but they're only about that big. Usually when you see these type of pickles, they come in the sweet, the sweet pickles, the relish, the ones you would make relish with. Um, but these are not. These have, um, I don't know if you can see the little garlic slivers in there. Um, they has, it has some seasoning in there. If you guys can see the little black things floating around in there. Um, I don't know if those are cloves or something, but um, these kosher pickles are so crunchy and they're not as tangy as a regular pickle. Um, I know everybody has their own 
cravings their own desire what they like but these are the ones I like and usually I like the spears the spears where you bite into the middle of it and you get the little seeds and stuff that's the ones I like the most but I'm gonna show you guys just when I say I'm I'm serious about my my pickles let me show you something don't laugh okay but let me show you something because if you have if you have a craving for something you can relate. If you have a, a craving, you can relate to me. I sometimes I'd be like, "Damn, am I crazy? Am I crazy? Like why are these pickles so good?" I was coming home from work every day eating three or four spears every morning or taking three or four spears to work every night. When I say, y'all better not laugh at me. Look, this bottle. And I got the spoon in there trying to get the, get my hand down there to get the last couple of one, the couple of pickles that were in there. These were kosher spears, but I don't particularly like this brand. But when I saw this bottle, or this jar, I should say, my mouth. Holy moly, my mouth responded by salivating instantly. I got this from Walmart and this, it says on the, on the jar that this is a gallon. This is a gallon and it has approximately 80 spears inside of there. 80 spears. You know how long this lasted for me? About a month. I bought this right before Super Bowl. And here we are, February, what, 10th? This last, I, I just finished this off last night. This lasted about a month. 80, 80 spears, 80 spears in like a month. Do the math, how many I was eating a day. So when I say it's something serious, it's serious. But these babies right here, let me show you something. Let me show you something. Am I giving you guys them Janet Jackson vibes? Somebody, <laughs> that's so cute. Somebody came on my um, comment section and said, I don't know what it is about her, but she gives me Janet Jackson vibes. Well, I wish I can get the, I wish I can have them Janet Jackson money vibes. Like, you know, send it to me. Money cometh. <laughs> money cometh. I'm going to speak that into existence. This year, I said for myself, I want multiple strands of income. How many, how many, how many can attest to that? I want multiple strands of income this year. So I am striving towards that goal. So thank you. Send, send them Janet Jackson vibes, Janet Jackson money vibes to me. But look at this, guys. Here it is. Looks bigger than what it is, but it's not. Mm -mm -mm. You hear that? They're delicious, guys. Mm -mm -mm. And I got these this morning. I went to a a Chaldean um, produce market, and these were there, and. This is my first time trying this brand and trying them from there. And with these, um, it has a slight, slight spice to it. Um, and it also has a slight sweetness to it. Let's see. Let's look what the ingredients are. So the ingredients are salt, sugar, black pepper, allspice, mustard seeds, garlic, dill weed, and oil. So, um, and some type of acetic acid and water, of course. And so with those, th those ingredients comes this 
And here is, this is the maker here. Now you see, um, I don't know if that's like a different um, uh, language. I don't, I don't know, but like I said, I got this from a Chaldean, Middle Eastern, um, well, I should say Middle Eastern produce store. And they had a bunch of different type of pickles that I just, I don't know what they all were for. They had white pickles. I mean, they had all kinds of type of pickles. But these are actually pretty good. Um, this bottle, I think it'll last me a week or two, maybe a week or two. My cravings are pretty bad. So thank you guys for watching. I'm not going to hold you very long, but you guys tell me, you guys comment down below and tell me if you have a pickle craving and if not a pickle craving, tell me what other type of craving you have because I would like to know. Please tell me I'm not crazy. <laughs> tell me I'm not crazy because it was the olives and now it's the pickles. So, and no, no, I know what you're thinking. If I was, I'd be rich. That's all I'm going to say about that. <laughs> so thank you guys for watching. Have a good day. Stay blessed. Multiple strands of income coming. Favor to you. Everybody have an awesome day. Bye.